<laughs> so welcome back, Dan. Yeah, thank you. It's, I'm a little rusty now. Yeah, but I think we'll be all right. We have taken care of Grand Colombia since you yeah. have been away. Good. But first of all, as always, let's begin with the new dev diary for today, which is on... Germany. Germany, wow. In, uh, in, or, or in is it slate. Germany with a J or Germany with a J? It's a Y, I think. Oh, it's a Y J Y J <laughs> Germany. Yeah. All right, cool. All right. So a new Germany. Yeah. So basically, uh, this is something we've been teasing a long time. Um, we found out that maybe not so surprisingly, people really like alternate history stuff in in Hoi Four. And a lot of the, the the main focus trees don't really have a lot of options for that. So we sort of set up a little plan, a long-term plan, to try and get them all into that path. Cool. So the first one we're going to show off, and this uh, update slash uh, DLC coming that we haven't announced yet, is going to have two countries being updated. Germany is the first one. Wait, uh, because two? Yes, the other one's secret so far. Damn it, I don't know, actually. It says, uh, you didn't read the dev diary, it says in the diary. But you said it was secret. Uh, I didn't say what it was. Yeah. Oh, you don't know what it is? No. It's, it's, no. I'll, no. I'll tell no. you later. Okay, cool. Uh. <laughs> it's, 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 it's almost playable. Yeah. No. Ooh. It's okay. Al almost. Okay. okay. <laughs> ba back on track. Um, anyway, so, so Germany is our first target um, because they are the most popular generally and they're also one of the things that sort of drive the mechanics of the game. Yeah. And the way to do, the way we set this up is that we've decided that the, the big gameplay um, kind of balance things. Uh, and things we want to change in the base tree are going to be free for everybody. Okay, cool. And, and then we're going to have alternate history paths, and those will be the DLC part, basically. Cool. So for Germany, you're kind of seeing like uh, the industry part that's new, and there's actually more stuff to come with with the industry. Let's see if I can bring it up bigger cool. here on the screen. Yeah, that works actually pretty well. Yeah, let's see, like that maybe. Um, there's actually some more stuff coming that I can't really announce yet, but we've been looking at redoing the whole... Uh, Atlant wall. I yes. know, right? Yes. We've been re looking at redoing a lot of the starting up for Germany, because the way that Germany works now is that they're pretty strong and then they get stronger. Whereas you kind of want the situation where they're, they're weaker, but have much more potential for quickly expanding in size and strength. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. So one of those parts is a new uh, industry tree uh, with a lot more options. I think uh, oh, trick is wrote. I think we went from like four focuses to sixteen or something here. I think it was that, yeah. Yeah, something like oh, that. There. Uh, yeah. Path of four focuses is now expanding to sixteen. Yeah. There's also a thing that uh, I can show you that comes later. I think. It, oh, uh, you can see oh, them oh, here no, actually. Uh, now I'm jumping the gun a bit, but you see a little icon here for Mifo builds. Uh, and this was uh, <laughs> such a penalty. I didn't know about it, so I went in and was like, "Oh yeah, what the hell a... is this?" But it's it's good if you got it right. <laughs> I haven't yet rebalanced the initial economy okay, to cool. offset for it. But the idea is that Germany <laughs> Germany did some illegal shenanigans <laughs> with loans and, and stuff <laughs> like that to kind of fund a lot of their uh, building up for the war. Of course they did. And this sort of puts you on a timer that it kind of forces you to go to war uh, and keep doing it. Uh, or you're gonna need to pay pay back basically, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Perfect. which makes a lot of the stuff like you know if the allies decide to challenge you on stuff much of a harder thing because now you're like, you know we kind of have to go to war within this time, or we're gonna start feeling these penalties as well and stuff like that. So it makes it a lot more interesting. So motivating Germany to go to war more. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> not that need it was needed, but it, it's more about <laughs> how, right? <laughs> Uh, once they start going, it's a little too easy to just back away and go do yeah. something and else. And then chill out for a while. That's yeah. usually what I do. I take one or two nations really yeah. quickly, then you sit yeah. back for a while and build Because historically, like, once Germany started gearing up for this war, I don't remember the time spans, but it was basically like, good luck trying to mobilize the country again yeah. uh, for the war. So once you start, you basically you completely step off the train and you're on it. So right? First World War style. Once you begin, there's no stopping it. Basically. <laughs> Okay, that's the focus, only the focus part. Yeah, so. that, that was a bit about the industry path. So, let's, so we uh, also have this, which I love. Yeah, the alternate <laughs> history path. Now, uh, the tree is at the bottom here, so I'm going to go do that big. first. The big part is what you can see here. Um, oh, they meet a bit. Obviously, an alternate history path for Germany is what if you oppose Hitler, right? And he had gotten rid of a lot of people <laughs> that could do this, but we figured 
logically, a lot of the military was still, you know, not really convinced about it. <laughs> <laughs> so 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 uh, yeah, I that. can leave that one on for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. Drika sent me this side, like, I, I need to spice it up. <laughs> um, anyway, so we decided that it would make sense to have uh, the military and kind of like the old Prussian guys kind of, you know, Not oppose, taking oppose shit. Hitler, right? Yeah. Um, so that is basically, if you, if you can see here, like, this is the old stuff, right? And we sort of... Oh. Isn't it slightly updated? Yeah, it's slightly updated. We'd move some stuff around... Uh, we moved some. Did we move the uh, fate one? of Greece? Oh, that one's actually. We're Isn't probably going to end up updating this one a little bit more, actually. Mm. Cool. Um, but this uh, whole tree here is sort of new stuff. So instead of instead of doing Rhineland, uh, basically people are are, are going to put Hitler in the spot, and this will cause a civil war. That you have to win. Um, and who's going to be leading the civil war? <laughs> It's it's my favorite guy. Uh, I don't remember. Is he like ninety years old at this point or something? It's so ridiculous. It's like yeah. no, no. He was it's not active. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was. <laughs> Hitler was really trying to get him into because he he was a big hero, right? Yeah. And Hitler was trying to get him into all sorts of pomp and stuff, and he wasn't really into the whole uh, Nazi thing very much at all. Wasn't he very much a monarch? He was extremely monarchist. Yeah. So so our idea is that like. The revolt, the revolt side is basically run by uh, August von Mackensen. <laughs> the, uh, but I mean, he's, he's such a short lease on life, right? Because he dies around nine, uh, 95 years old, so you have him for a while. But his goal is, is to bring back the Kaiser. Uh, it's like from one guy with a massive, beautiful <laughs> hat to one guy with the... Like, yeah. like, his beard is perfect. Yeah. And to be fair, another guy with expansionistic yeah. uh, ideas, right? Uh, but yeah, it's it's kind of a battle of the best beard and hats here. <laughs> <laughs> the old versus the new. Yeah, if, if only we could get the crown presence in as well. She has an, also an amazing hat. But the focus, like yeah. pictures, that, yeah, that hat. The, oof. I can't zoom in more. Hopefully you can see it, but uh, the pickle haube is, is amazing. But anyway, oh. so you have basically after new the graphics. Civil War. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. New graphics. Can't we just, once he returned, all <laughs> the German soldiers get the hat instead? <laughs> Oh, I think the, the baked ins <laughs> would have to oh, redo no. everything. I know, Damn I know. It. I okay, checked sorry. up on it. Anyway, so you have two big choices here: uh, reviving the Kaiserreich and and getting the Kaiser back, because the Kaiser at this time is in Netherlands. So you have to. They can actually uh, they can actually uh, refuse to give him back. <laughs> what? Yeah, uh, basically house arrest him and stuff, and, oh. uh, <laughs> which gives you you know you can stomp them then. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm not sure if anyone's going to do it. We figured it'd be a fun thing for multiplayer. Yeah. And then the second path is is to kind of work your way, because maybe the Kaiser isn't the most democratic guy, right? To work your way more towards more of a election thing, with, with uh, although with some monarchy. This is all sort of monarchy stuff. And this leads me to one of my favorite named focuses, the, the Mannheim <laughs> project rather than the Manhattan project. Oh, God. So the idea here is that rather than, you know, uh, scaring away or murdering all your uh, researchers, you actually have more of a research path when you go the democratic path. So uh, you, you're going to be getting that six tech slot. Very uh, nice, very nice. And, so, and um, nice bonuses and stuff. And uh, shared RNG programs between a bunch of countries. Uh, the other point of this path is to kind of paint up Russia as, as the great threat menace, as it says here. And kind of be the, you know... Big bad wolf. Yeah. So you're going to be fighting the, fighting the Russians. Because, I mean, this is still Germany, so they're going to be fighting in, in one direction and the other one. And then there's a lot of options for how to... If you go with the Kaiser path here, how to deal with, like, uh, you know, what's your view on Britain... <laughs> <laughs> and stuff like that. And and colonies. Give and me back my Kaiser. No, that's it. No, that's <laughs> yeah. You're going down. Yeah, gotta gotta get the Kaiser Assassinate back. Assassinate Mussolini. Yes. Wow. I uh you know, gotta give something for people to investigate, but the idea is that, you know, as fellow kings, you can start talking to uh is it Victor Emmanuel? I believe. Uh, uh the the king of uh Maybe. I'm super bad at king King of Italy anyway. I think that's I think that's the name. I'm, I'm a terrible person if I got it <laughs> wrong. Um, 
and you kind of start getting monarchy going in Italy as well. Nice, very yeah. nice. So uh, I there's a lot of a lot this. of really cool alternate history paths here, yeah. uh, but you gotta you gotta basically side how to deal with the the British fleet, right? Either you have to basically challenge them, or or concede that you can't really have you, you're not really allowed to have a fleet that's challenging Britain. Cool. So that's their sort of path around here. That's pretty awesome. Yep. Like I, like I told you just before it, I've been trying to, I want to try it out this path, but I've accidentally just by reflex picked Rhineland <laughs> two or three times in a row now. It's like yeah, oh, we, we damn it. We actually considered putting like the choice in the event, but I figured it'd be so hidden, and people are so used to it now that they just oh the Rhineland event click right. So I, I wanted Oof. to make sure it's shown in the focus tree here. Maybe it could be just wait. You do the Rhineland. And then you have another option that is just, that's it, Hitler, you're going down instead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if oh, you assassinate Mussolini, does Italy become competent? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> they got to modify competent Italy plus 20% attack. I'd be, I'd be tempted to do it, <laughs> but <laughs> I don't know if the king was very competent no. either. Uh, he, I think he was very much a figurehead most of the time. But yeah, um, and Germany can get some colonies here in China as well. Uh, looking at this, I feel like we need to add some beer-related uh, <laughs> achievement. Though. Instead Sing of a fort, be it's a beer house. Sing Tao beer is awesome. So like, yeah. Uh, is there uh, anything more? What else well, we, we got have to talked show? a lot about this focus tree. Yeah, wow. it's uh, it's so much really. There's also a lot of like I wanted to show some more of the events, but uh, yeah, I, I, I'm gonna leave them for there. people to investigate. Like um, I really like the stuff we've been doing to to Germany here, and what was I, I want to now. I want to keep going for yeah. all the other countries too. What was what was this? <gasps> oh yeah, this is like uh, you know. The to swarm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> the idea is to get a lot of the neutral countries sort of on your side in this Ooh. kind of big anti-Russian uh, thing. Yeah. So EU, just out of time. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if there is a real path where France becomes your friend, though. But I've also done some interesting things with the AI to try and balance yeah. things. Because if Germany is no longer a scary fascist threat, France at this point had a lot of communist shenanigans going on. Ooh. So we tried to make it more interesting that if you're going strongly and you're no longer a big threat and stuff, France is going to start maybe sliding towards communism, which will give you an interesting kind of, you know, What's it called? Two front, war. Two front uh, squishy situation. Cool. Because our goal is still that Germany is going to end up in war. But yeah. Very nice. So that was our dev diary talk right now. And uh, yeah. well, I look forward to it. I hope you two do as well. Or you too. You 469 people <laughs> do. <laughs> <laughs> so um, now we'll go back to our very great faction at faction phase and our <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I've, I've, been, I've been out of this uh, for a few weeks now, working on, by the way, playing Germany. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> but that's why uh, I said working all the time. Well, I've been, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, um, so I was going to say, like, okay, let's invade South America. I was going to say, what's the plan? <laughs> Do you need to save Germany? <laughs> yeah. They look like they're I, in I trouble. I don't know, we, maybe. Like, we were going to invade just and take over all of Africa, not South America, as I said, but yeah, uh -huh. all of Africa. I was like, okay, let's gather our fleet right here so we can invade them. And then I already see Ecuadorian troops walking here. I was like, come on! <laughs> <laughs> really invading before me? Second Ecuador. Yeah, so I decided <laughs> instead I get, got military access in Natural Spain, then did a small invasion from here to just land right here. Then mm. I cancelled the military access in Natural Spain, so I would also get some territory. Nice. Because I'm kind of greedy. Um, so yeah, I think we'll just unpause the game and actually begin because I think we need to liberate, yeah, is liber liberate yeah. Africa a tiny bit. Is more. nationalist Spain joined the war or not? Uh, they are in the Axis. So oh, I was too thinking, bad. It would have been great if we could attack them if they were in the. Oh, actually, if we're gonna save the Axis, then we can just ask for military access because we're already at war with the well, yeah. allies. All we have to do is basically declare war against Soviet Union if we want to try and save them. So uh, maybe we should just declare war against them. That would be a bit disturbing for them. They would be, holy shit, what's going on? We're at war yeah, with them right now. I think maybe. And that would be kind of fun. So our goal would basically be sunset invasion to save the Axis, which kind of it's doesn't make sense. Like, consider it's it this way, weird. right? <laughs> if, if our objective is to kind of destroy everybody, right? Yeah. Uh, imagine yeah. how nasty it's going to be to try and take Europe if it's all Russia, right? Yeah. But why in hell are my troops retreating? No! What are you doing? 
Did you peace out? Didn't you say you peace out? But, but they're retreating for some reason. No! No, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop! 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 What are you doing? No! Oh, oh, they are no convoys, but yeah. they're still retreating with con Dan, how does this work? <laughs> I think what happened was, yeah, that's interesting actually. <laughs> Let's put it. Let's put it like that. <laughs> it's interesting. Okay, nice. Yeah, um, uh, I see. Because right, it it creates a new order, right? So if you were had lost all the convoys while you were at sea, it's gonna just go to default retreat, I think. <laughs> so enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> so, bugs. I wonder how you managed that, though. I I don't know. I was pretty sure. Oh, I can. Yeah. Uh, it does make sense. Okay, wait, wait. Now I have 23 convoys. If can you, I, if you can I now tell them to well, stop have the, have and go them right land, here? And then you should be able to. No, yeah. Now when I have convoys again, they can go back. Yeah. The <laughs> problem is, like, once you hit zero, they're just going to retreat, right? So. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's an interesting mechanic feature. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, yeah, it's we totally really meant to be like that. Yeah. We really yeah. just need to get over here and actually defend and counterattack right France right here. Yeah. Because I was planning, once we maybe get over here, Maybe we can then go up and help, well, naturally Spain, that we just secure yeah. Gibraltar area. So they can't actually, well, move in and out with their Oh, well, they uh, shouldn't be able to. Spain is controlling both yeah. sides. But they can very easily be broken right now, so I really yeah. just want to secure this area by taking everything right here. Yeah. So if I actually just assault right here, then that would probably be pretty nice. Yeah. Get in um, right here, you're getting... Ka Katya is worried that about the American front, because, you know, have you seen the American front? Uh, let's see... They really don't like us. Could we somehow make sure that they, they like us? They have a lot of divisions, by the way. Yeah. And the Dominican Republic doesn't. If if we say like this, um, I call upon all of us to boost party popularity in America. Have you looked at the focus they're doing? The fascist... I know, I know, I know, but... <laughs> I think we, at this we... point it's inevitable, right? But we it's against Germany. Use... It's not against us. Exactly. But So if everyone just pulled them and... They become fascist ASAP. Then I, I think you might be next, though. Uh, never mind. <laughs> uh, so uh, maybe maybe we should um, try to get troops to the <laughs> northern side of our <laughs> borders. Sh ASAP. Surely we can we can buffer them with the Salvador and hold out in Panama <laughs> or something. We're so dead. <laughs> Everybody, <laughs> fall back to Panama. <laughs> Actually, I know I don't I don't know if we should fall back all the way right there. Yeah, no, probably not. Uh, so. Oh, right, I think it told half of my divisions to go all the way back here. That was why it was weird. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, so, yeah, fall back with half of them. I don't care, really, that we... <laughs> half of the divisions need to go there ASAP. <laughs> we won't have enough convoys for that. <laughs> so, oh, God. A couple of my troops are now leaving. Uh, the rest of you didn't... Let's see. You don't have enough convoys, so you're just going to be reassigned right here, for now, at least. While the rest of you just move in... <laughs> Oh god, this is not gonna end well. I don't, <laughs> should, should, I don't know if they're listening, should I tell them to fall, fall back to Panama? Uh, like, if Archangel, if everyone could just get over to North America, or, yeah, Mexico I think they're gonna be kind of toast, but... <laughs> uh, hopefully they have built forts, but I don't know how much that would actually help. Uh, and they have not built... Oh, here, we have one fort. Yeah. One fort right there and one fort right there. What's cool. the What's the Asia situation? Is... Uh... Japan in the war because maybe they'll start spreading out the fleet so much you could they're in the war sneak around up but yeah they have also <laughs> at least 240 divisions, oh dear which means they have around 350 and a huge fleet and there we go no wait that was Philippines oh wait they are at war with us already yeah they're just not deciding to push yet until they have well mass enough divisions so let's just accept a couple of non-aggression packs <laughs> um Whoops. Oh, here we have know. 10 divisions from uh, Bangalis, Bolivia. I, I, sti I still believe in the... I think we lost someone as well who's sick. Yeah. So I'm not sure if One which One person country. is sick. Or two, maybe, even. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's it's that time of year. In, in uh, I'm going to do something like this. Yeah. So, let's try to get l two level 10 forts right here. <laughs> and just if they manage to take everything all the way down here, we might yeah. be able to stop them right there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You guy, you need to rush right here and see if we can just take the Panama Canal. Yeah. Come on, come on, quickly now, quickly now, quickly now. Don't forget Panama, exactly. Yeah, that's a good point. Come on, come on. Go. Just 
<laughs> because otherwise we're doomed. We don't have anything to issue in that. Time. If you're really lucky, then. <laughs> they're yeah. doing naval aviation in the Panama Canal. Oh. Uh, come on, El Salvador. One of us need to grab it. You can do it. Okay, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> that that was so close. But they are still invaders somewhere in central. Oh crap, crap. Oh no. 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 Oh dear. No, no. <laughs> but no, they're, but oh, they crap, really yeah. stress the mode though. They have no org. You might be okay. Uh, I need to assign plane somewhere right there. Come on, get over here. We have 30 fighters. <laughs> yeah, uh, assign, get assigned right there. And, yeah, yeah, and do something. Uh, oh crap, no, no, no. They managed to do it. Oh dear. You couldn't beat those guys? They had like no org. Oh no. Now they're back up in org. No, um, we have some more divisions coming right there. Uh, should we send our divisions to the far north or should we just take them for ourselves and leave our allies to die? <laughs> <laughs> we have done it before. You know, you know what I would vote for. Okay, let's... Oh wait, we can't actually move them because we don't have any convoys. No. That man. Have you, have you requested... Len uh, I don't know. I guess nobody... <laughs> we can't. Is everybody else just equally bad off? Uh, we're pretty much all bad off. Like having, I, I thought we would be stronger, but apparently, as <laughs> having splitting up the nation between so many is that everyone has bad divisions. Yeah. No one has any good stuff. I don't know if everybody's really played super optimally either. No, but like... <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> Especially I, since I, my nice. I, I saw uh, was it Venezuela? Oh crap! They're trying to push war in. tanks. Or, oh good, good. We might be able to break them now. <gasps> come on, but come on. Take, take, take them, Daniel Castro. <laughs> Yeah. What? Well, it's I, I don't get that reference. I'm bad. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Come on. Okay, one division were caught by the <laughs> English Navy. But uh, So about this saving access thing. Uh, yeah, we're not going to do that. S save yourselves. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> he didn't have org either. Yeah, that's true. I didn't have org since I strategically oh, redeployed right. all you're the way. Oh, right. You strategically redeployed, you're right. Until yeah. the last province. Good! We actually managed to grab Panama Canal. Ooh. Very nice. Nice. Uh, let's have that as my third build port place. Or build fourth place. Yeah. So, ba oh, actually, that's actually the best province to defend in. Since we have a river just in front of it. Yeah. Or the canal itself. So, we build a level 10 fort right here. So, let's actually bump the priority right there. So, hope you think will you're going to need it. that? Or you sh oh, you mean for holding out once they get yeah. there? I yeah, gonna, exactly. Like, once probably you should States build a naval fort. Oh, God, if they, they are already you. falling back right now. Uh, so you guys, uh, yeah, yeah. How much factories would be giving up though, falling back all over that? Oh crap, we're f losing so many divisions by random naval invasions. Ugh, that's horrible. Uh, let's just everyone go right there instead. Run away. <laughs> God, we lost like... Wait, how many divisions did we actually lose from this? Oh wait, no, we are signed them. Yeah. Oh, um, <laughs> what's that naval battle? Are your stuff caught by the fleet? Uh, what? Naval? The, the naval battle outside uh, Tunis there. Oh, um... There. It the was one convoys. that's ongoing is that... Oh, it's not ours. Oh, it's someone else's. Uh, people are now trying to return. No, let's just have everyone right here. And the rest of the region as well. Guard this single province. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, we uh, are falling back quite quickly right here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think El Salvador will be our first victim. Yeah. Chat's asking if I have my own channel too. I, I, I don't. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I spend my YouTube time watching watching cat uh, YouTube uh, videos instead. Yeah, we we don't have any steel anymore. <laughs> we got everything we have oh, from oh. United States. <laughs> so now we're trying to trade with Soviet Union, but they're basically intercepting all. Oh, uh, good luck in declare war for them then. Yeah, but we do have lots of like spare equipment right now. We have quite a nice yeah. stockpile. So if maybe but you got to make it count though. Yeah, you know. We could should, always... Should, should we gamble on the AI messing up if you fall back? You can prepare a naval invasion, right? Um, so once they get to Panama, we cut, cut them off. And then maybe crush them. Oh, you mean Make, that way. We build a giant trap over Central America, right? Yeah. We, we could do this for all our divisions. Are you using Marines instead of... Uh... We, since we were going to go Marines. All oh, right. Okay, we could go like this because we have enough experience for that. That would just immensely... Yeah. <laughs> Increase the power of our divisions, but we have no piercing yeah. whatsoever. So if they come with tanks, we're screwed. Yeah. And uh, chat's asking about the twin generals. They're the two Colombian battle brothers. Yeah. 
What what's wrong with them? We have um, Gustavo and we have uh, yeah. Toro. Toro. Gustavo Toro. That means bull, the right? The dream team. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Well, um, or in time, Shakira we're actually, yeah, we're actually looking into improving that selection thing. So it's it's instead of it being a dice roll, we'll actually look at picking a portrait you haven't seen. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Um, also, with the uh, chain of command, we're going to be adding a whole bunch of generic portraits uh, because you you need more generals now as well. Cool. It's the sam same person with your personality. <laughs> <laughs> It's actually a good point. It'd be kind of cool if you could pick the uh, pick the name for the uh, you know you breed them. Breed your generals. My son. I will make this general my son. <laughs> what the fuck? That? What? <laughs> well, you could adopt the general, right? You would get your last name. Oh, come on. That'd be great. Uh, I think I'm actually gonna prioritize convoys so we can get some more and I can trade with them. Yeah. Actually, if I just removed my troops from here, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I removed my troops from here, we wouldn't need as many convoys for just trading, and we would be able to have more for trade and get our steel. Yeah. Need. Uh, let's not trade for any chromium anymore. <laughs> Out of interest, how much uh, how much steel would be available to you if you could build up the infrastructure like we can in 1.5? But oh, uh, maybe you're busy fighting. <laughs> uh, we actually don't have any seed. Ah, okay, you're toast on. Yeah, zero. <laughs> Damn it. This is what uh, probably Katya meant with, uh, well, Colombia is shit. <laughs> you need to improve them. <laughs> Update them. I thought that was uh, the high command that wasn't very good. No, everything is basically not very good, okay. unfortunately. I'll, I'll add some stuff. Colombia is my favorite. <laughs> Shakira. Uh, working on Wiki2 does that for you. Yeah, like that, that has been removed for me. Like, uh, or destroyed for me, my YouTube suggestions. Uh -huh. Since I was linked a bunch of Shakira songs, and everything in my suggestions is different Shakira <laughs> songs, Lady Gaga now. It's just, come uh, on! But we still have our fleet, ships don't lie, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And well, we lost our ship, so we had to change to our ship, my ship don't lie. <laughs> but then we received more again, so we <laughs> changed it back to my ships don't lie. That is good. I'm not sure. I'm sure. I'm not sure that navy can do very much, honestly, at this point. <laughs> Four but. level one destroyers. It's yeah. <laughs> it's but, not the best. Um, did we lose the Cuban player, or are they did they just basically going defensive while we're dying? Um, I'm pretty sure everyone. Uh, I think Cuba. Yeah, you were lost, but um, sense well, sick person. But um, yeah. we managed to. Oh right, didn't you leave when everyone was lost by Canada or something? Yeah. We did manage to save everyone again and then return them. Ah. Uh. But uh, right now, yeah, Third Empire, Haiti. Oh, actually, wait. Yeah, it's Dominican Republic that is gone right now. Yeah. Oh, crap. Here we have United Kingdom falling back right here. Oh, oh dear. Attacking right here. Uh, okay, never mind. Let's just do this. Everyone return back home if you can. <laughs> Who cares? It's barely anything we get from here. So everyone just try to return. And for that, we need to cancel all our trades so we have some... <laughs> All our convoys are destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> we can't return. You should have probably just ignored the trading until you got the guys home. But I still thought, we, are we going to have some trading? Okay, <laughs> let's do this. Produce some more. Uh, we need to trade for a tiny bit steel. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, let's let's cancel that. And see, uh, South America. Uh, we can trade with <laughs> Bolivia because we don't need yeah. convoys for that. You know what would be cool would if there was a random chance to pick up some convoys when you took an enemy port of someone. Oh, that could be cool. You could have like... <gasps> wait, 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 we can. All the convoys are enough for two divisions at a time. <laughs> but they all might get intercepted on the way home. Oh, actually, three divisions. Yeah. Nice. Oh, wait, what? I like Even how uh, when this campaign started, everybody was like, Oh, this is gonna be gonna so crush easy. everybody, it's gonna be so easy. <laughs> but they didn't count on the devs greediness of I'm gonna have everything and... <laughs> Yeah. The Yalta conference is now f Well, because, you know, Germany is uh, it's about yeah. to get toasted. Yeah, but <laughs> you're still in North Africa. It. Don't retreat. You're still in North Africa? Oh. I left the one province. <laughs> no. <laughs> Optimal play. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> well, did you pull everybody out already? <laughs> uh, I think... Everyone has now... No, 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 we're, we're nine divisions. Now di nine divisions. Because you could maybe pull it off. Saved it. Saved it. I don't, we don't know how many of those divisions there are, though. 
they're going for it anyway. Do you even care. have convoys to transport it home? <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> but let's try to get some at least. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. No, why are they hashtag blame podcast? <laughs> da Daniel's behind the wheels. I'm just here to wisecrack stuff. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh. Uh, who's invading right here? Greece. Go Greece. They don't even have Greece. Oh, they have this one. Yeah. <laughs> so they're invading from the small islands. They even <laughs> lost Crete. <laughs> wow. Green you know, marines with artillery icon, yeah. We should we should do a single play Greece session, Daniel, where we rock the uh, the music from uh, the, the musical soundtrack and do little dance numbers. What happened with you, Dan? You were all for all. <laughs> <laughs> now it's Shakira and sorry. You Can't have help changed. myself. You have changed. Yeah. Is it the Kaiser? What did uh. he do to you? <sighs> by the way, have you uh, swung, by, uh, swung by the uh, sound studio no? lately? I noticed it, so like when, when I zoomed in, the, the new stuff is pretty cool. Uh, a little teaser. We've been doing some pretty cool stuff with, with sounds. Oh, nice. To make stuff feel much more majestic <laughs> and... Uh, they're coming. It's, it's coming later. It's cool. Oh, nice. You should swing back the swing back uh, to Kumukun and check it out. Yeah, I will try. Um, so uh, yeah, United States are coming closer <laughs> and closer. <laughs> no, <laughs> uh, we only have a level four fort so far, so uh. it's taking a while. Can I? Can I? Uh, <laughs> I need to. Uh, can you click on someone on the front battle? I want to see what the enemy general is. It's Eisenhower, yeah. yeah. It's Eisenhower is coming at us. <laughs> and you can, can compare to that. <laughs> like, if everyone just gave a single player all the resources and all the land, we would have been so much better. Yeah. Shakira Minister. That. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this complaint. Yeah, I don't know if I can make Shakira Minister. <laughs> I feel like it would probably... Not be very historical. But we're doing unhistorical things. I also we don't think it's it. a real name, so I can't put it in the random name pool either. Oh. But yeah, we are I crushing that like tank at least. Yeah. Come on, grab that steel for us. Maybe we can hold it for a yeah. little while at least. Oh. If we just cut them off everywhere right here, it might be possible for us to hold it for a little while. Yeah. And uh, let's just grab these. Oh yeah, guys. by the way, uh chat, the uh Bratin is just posting there is the the guy who wrote today's dev diary. He's one of our content designers. If you want to pester him with detailed questions and distract him from defending against <laughs> America, you can do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah there we That's go. actually a good point, Daniel. We should add start adding achievements for, for <laughs> streams where we fail horrendously at doing yeah. something. So what would this be? I mean, this would Don't be this would be the faction faction phase achievement. So you have to lead these particular countries in a faction, <laughs> and then then successfully beat the allies, I guess, or something. Yeah, yeah. But you have to do this split too, which would be kind of horrible because if you just lead a faction and take everything yourself, then it's fine. But you need to have exactly this split. Yeah, exactly this, this one, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not losing. I own all yeah. my territory left. No, inv no invasions right here. I guess we could do it a multiplayer achievement or something. Oh god. Uruguay is coming. <laughs> They're coming to save us. But they have a lot of convoys. How did they get all the convoys? They, have, they got all the good land right here. Oh. I thought I was stealing See, the I've best had land this by argument. taking this. Like, QA tells me that Uruguay is good, right? Yeah. They uh, are. I, I thought, yeah. We need to look over that a bit. Colombia should be better, right? <laughs> so, are we trading home any... <laughs> no, we aren't, because they're blocking everything. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Well, we also need to take control over this entire province to be able to get control of the resources first, of course. Never yeah. mind, never mind. See, we already have the achievement description in the chat now. Lead these countries successfully and defend against the allies, I guess. <laughs> uh, I need to basically send all my divisions out yeah. right here to try and beat this. 
Yeah. Otherwise, we won't get anything. So, chat is asking, is he playing single or multi? And uh, I think that's the problem here, right? Because this yeah. is multiplayer, but people aren't very cooperative. <laughs> if which, is, at least, is what Daniel is yeah, like, blaming his lack of success. If it would have been single on. player, I would have had tanks. I would have had everything. I would have had a real navy. Well, uh, Bjorn had tanks. He had great war tanks. I, I saw them. <laughs> that does not count like <laughs> tanks that are <laughs> steel plated horses. Yeah. Oh crap, no, you're supposed to be a I don't think he had the economy for it either, so I think he only no, could and then he one left. Division. And then he left the day he got the tanks, <laughs> or because VAB, and then the AI just messed it up. Oh no. See, see Bjorn's posting, he says they're good tanks now. Okay, let's, let's find one of your tanks and see what kind of tanks they are. Oh, those uh, are defense actually, we can do it like here. Requestland... Wasn't he Venezuela? Um, Requestland is... I don't remember. We can't lend these any. Or it doesn't have any. But he has great war tanks. Hmm. Why can't we lend these great war tanks? Are you sure that's him? They're not counted as armored vehicles. I'm pretty sure that's <laughs> the thing. <laughs> They're probably counted as like inventory or something. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can we break them now? Yeah. <laughs> we definitely can't do it. We could try and license them instead, but... Uh, let's just ignore this then <laughs> and just return home. Uh, we won't get that extra steel, unfortunately. I, I still believe in cent Central American trap. But uh, get get, get some marines ready to cut off the but enemy. These once are they our marines. <laughs> <laughs> they do have a bonus still in attacking from rivers and stuff. Yeah, but probably don't need all of those to hold that. So oh, I'm gonna grab these these units, these four, and do there. Yeah, actually, we control the canal, so that should be fine. Yeah, but the only problem is we uh, need uh, navy for Uruguay that. Uruguay to be charging the enemy like some kind of orc horde here. Orc orc. orc orc. Orc orc. Can we grab? Yeah, let's try to jump in with a navy right here because actually we won't be able we won't be able to do a naval invasion because we won't have any superiority. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to stop them. I guess, uh, I guess it's kind of hard to beat through all those divisions up in the mountains. Maybe. Maybe we could draw some off and do something else with them. At least have you know one of the other players die for us instead. <laughs> That's what we're doing. I don't know if they're listening in, but yes. <laughs> That's the entire time what we've been doing. They've been doing the hard work. We have been just been Because America, in. if America is started to send stuff to Europe, maybe there's an inning somewhere where we could sneak in. North South America is such a good name. <laughs> yes. We used to have North Northern Sweden as well. North Northern Sweden. Yeah. So it's not it was here? Or? No, the northest part of North, North Sweden. North Northern Sweden. Yeah. So here. Yes. Now it's a proper name of Lapland, but <laughs> yes. North Northern Sweden. And it was North Northern Finland. Yes. <laughs> and but this is still Nord Norge. <laughs> but I think that's the real name. Yeah, I know. I, know, I don't know. I probably now insulted everybody in Norway. No, Norway. I think it's, it's okay though. You guys are just speaking sort of Swedish, but in a funny way. Yeah. <laughs> we are pushing back the US right here. Yeah. They hoard the Uruguay soldiers. You're still, still in the m mountains. Though. I put, they had tanks and stuff. So <laughs> I was heavily dependent on my steel imports from the US. Yeah, I was too. I'm trying to take all the steel now from you guys, but I'm not getting very much. Oh dear. But there's got to be some steel somewhere, right? <laughs> not that we can get. Um, because we can't trade for any steel over land, because then the US will just, well, destroy it. Yeah. We have a couple of, oh god, they're just intercepting my troops now, and then I'm trying to return with everyone. Don't mess with America. We didn't. We were nice against them, and then they just joined allies and declared war against us. Oh, mm -hmm. everyone, still, still, boost part of popularity. We might be able to stage a coup and destroy them. It's gonna take too long. I mean, their, well, we their are support is nations. enormous. So. We are a lot of nations. We are like eight players. Yeah, maybe. And then we could use Sage a coup. But they have the resistance stuff and everything as well. Yeah. Because I remember putting that in after you guys kept That's doing it. that to me in multiplayer. We don't have enough equipment. <laughs> that too. <laughs> to even stage a coup. So, um, yeah, well, we can at least try. Maybe we would be lucky with events. Yeah, it looks like the Dominican Republic's corner there as well. They're, in a, they're trapped on the half island there. <laughs> oh god, slowly but steadily we are moving out with our entire force. Yeah. But I will just have to make sure that, well, I press them to just leave their current stock equipment. 
Here how is, uh, how's, is, how's Germany doing now? Are they still holding on? Uh, I, yeah, I mean, they've been holding are. that line for a long time now. Yeah, because of help with Vichy France that cut off right here from France. So they basically have one, one province. Oh, wait, wait. They want Belgium and Netherlands yeah, too. Never mind. Never mind. It's a slippery slope. Yeah, I think they will fall quite soon. But Italy seems to be the one yeah. pretty much holding them together. Yeah. Did we boost them? I don't remember. I don't think so. I think if you did, you would have. Uh, would, this would not have happened. <laughs> they probably did. Because if we'd boosted them, we would have boosted everyone. I talked to people about it, and it didn't sound like anyone had boosted them. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're losing now every single battle right here. Yeah. But that's because we are attacking. Yeah, so should, should you though? Maybe I'd, I'd just have a skeleton force hold the line and, and then con conserve the equipment, you know? Yeah. And then you... But I you think... Know, the El Salvadorian Iron Fist wait, will strike later. Isn't the original El Salvador land right here? Yeah. So if maybe El Salvador built a fort right here to be able to stop them and maybe everyone can just gather up right here because I don't think we have any players up here. No. It's oh, just El Salvador. AI, is that the AI reinforcing up there? Yeah. I don't know. No, no, no. Uruguay is a player. Bolivia is is Bolivia still a player? Yeah. Yeah. So it should not be any. So I think we should be able to just fall back. Cuba is also a player. So there are only players here, from what it seems yeah. like. So we should be able to pull back. Yeah. Uh, let's see. One point three million versus one point two million. So we're losing quite a bit. Yeah. Let's see, troops are returning, slowly but steadily. Half of them getting intercepted and killed off on the way home. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem when you're at war with both Britain and America, right? Yeah, and it needs to transfer a troop from. <laughs> <laughs> if only like you'd taken that, that one province, you know? You have three No, no, it was, I couldn't because I need to take this too, since I need to control the state to get that steel. All oh, right. And that was just way too many troops right there. So it was it was just me knowing that um, it would have worked. Yeah. That's why I retweeted it first time. But then you convinced me to do something wrong. So hashtag... Venta, what was it? Blah me chat? I don't know. It was something we blame, did before. Blame chat? <laughs> Not blame chat. We, we, it was someone that wrote it wrong. Blam we, chat. Blam chat. Blam the chat. Blam chat. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we're in serious... Trouble. <laughs> I, like, I don't know. Would they ever break us if we stood there on level 10 fort? They, they would invade somewhere, right? Yeah, eventually they would, but... Well, we... Once that line stocks, they are going to try and invade somewhere yeah. below you, and you can't really spread out either. No, that's true. All right, we have one division right here. Garrisoning Although, it's going to be a while for them to go through all the jungles and stuff. Yeah. They moved that from the port city. No, it's just they still have troops back there. Yeah. Chat better than a streamer. <laughs> Lamb chat. Uh, maybe we should do like a, a, a chat play session once where they get to make all the. Yeah, you did. We, we can call it blame chat, right? Hashtag blame chat. Yeah, chat because makes all the decisions for oh, us. That could be nice. But shouldn't we do that in hot code then? Because that would be even better. Yeah, I mean. Like chat chooses focus, focus crashes game, hashtag blame chat. <laughs> Yeah, we can do that. We can play one of the new ones. That <gasps> then we make a chat general. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a general, but yeah. instead of a head, it's I mean, just a question mark. We have to be mark. the field marshal then, right? Yeah. And you and me are generals under him. Yeah, and then but instead of a head, we just have a question mark. Yeah. With a hat on. Or, or like a Twitch symbol <laughs> or something. <laughs> like Twitch plays Pokemon. Yeah. Twitch plays Hearts of Iron. Yeah. It's gonna be difficult, but <laughs> move unit A thirty-seven, four <laughs> steps to the right. Yeah. <laughs> no, they would have haven't handled it like big micromanagement. Like focus on tanks. Then we do a quick vote on that, or yeah. yes or no. Focus on this. Yes, no. Probably like war declares diplomacy. Yeah. Um, which armies should go to which front? Maybe if we split them up. <laughs> you know, it's more split up now with the chain of commands. So you can go like these twenty-five divisions go here. Yeah. Stuff. So we. It might work. Twitch plays Victoria free. <laughs> only, only, only in your heads. Yeah, only in your head. We're never making that. Yeah. We might make Victoria well, 4. Yeah. Because 3 is just... It's so old. It's just a meme now. Yeah. Let's just skip it. Like Rome 2. It doesn't sound good. Rome 3. My standard response is I'm just, you know, we're holding out for Half-Life 3 
so yeah. we don't break their their thunder, right? Sounds nice. Since they ha <laughs> Bla hashtag blame Gabe. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, he, don't say that. He will just shut us down. <laughs> no steam for you. Yeah. Actually, yeah, Victoria's Secrets. Have you heard any more about Victoria's no, Secrets? No, no, he's just very busy now with like work or something. Yeah, like so space he, stuff rather yeah. than like Victorian Rough. dating sim. I don't know. It's wrong priorities if you ask me. Do Vic free or all unsubscribe? Well, I guess I'm fine with unsubscribing, but they're not paying us money right now on Twitch. So well, uh, we, you get follow us. By, we get paid by the hour anyway, so yeah, well, we, uh -huh. we can we can just blame the chat all day here. <laughs> Total War ruined Rome too. <laughs> Okay, we have now pulled back with all <laughs> our divisions. Let's see, how many did we lose, though? I think we lost five divisions. Yeah. Or maybe just three. I don't remember yeah. how many we were. I think we were 21 or 23. Yeah. And right here, we're just holding right now. Yeah. They might Honestly, never, yeah. They might we never reach us, which is pretty nice. So, we, c we can definitely pull some of those divisions off. Could we do anything with them to, to get to America? Like, I don't think so, because they have such a massive... Like, we, there's no way... Actually, Wait, zero? That. Zero. You somehow enable superiority there. Two. We could technically maybe invade... But we would somehow need to make an invasion order that will go around this area. <laughs> yeah. So if we invade from here, and then take a province, like, there, it might be possible to get around them. But can we do it from both sides? No, we definitely can't. Not that side. No, but it's very likely most of their fleet is, is spread out over Europe now, helping. Yeah. So uh, if we take you could maybe, if you don't actually do anything right, you could get away with just sort of sprinkling a bit. We take that province and then try to naval invade, let's see, somewhere right here. Probably you will get caught on the way though. Yeah, maybe. But, um, well, you never know until you try. Let's damn it, we are crossing that province. And then you can province. blame the chat instead. C come on, Dad, we, ne we need to be able to... Oh, God, that was just me accidentally yeah. scrolling down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if we need to, like, move this one, like, move naval invasion orders. Yeah. Wait, what happened with the naval invasion order? It disappeared. I somehow deleted it. Yeah. How, how is that possible? So we need to do something even further up. Mm -hmm. No, we can't, we can't, because we're passing through this territory. It doesn't work then. We can't label them Oh dear. Hmm. <laughs> Can we make a Minecraft song about how it's for? Oh, not him. Not him. Ban him. Ban him. Why? It's, I had it's just a Minecraft singer. I had this random guy who constantly spammed everything about making Minecraft song. Like everything, sent me personal messages, sent me everything. <laughs> so I made. Is he stalking? I, I have many, is he, I have, is <laughs> he your creeper stalker? I have many things allowed. Like I don't allow the very, very offensive thing. Or if you write anything Minecraft or yeah. Minecraft song related, you get an instant bam in my chat. Like that's the only thing I had as a oh bam. Dear. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I mean, uh, yeah, I wonder if we can pull something off in 10 minutes. The idea was that this this is going to be on the end of this campaign because we figured we would toast, basically. Yeah. Uh, it can only get worse when Germany finally falls and uh, the Allies come for you yeah. as well, right? Let's see if we can get naval priority right here. I wonder if someone buffed the Allies. That's quite possible, actually. Yeah. Because we were talking about attacking them first. So maybe that's what the thing uh, was. You need to engage right here. Come on. You four destroyers, destroy a carrier. <laughs> Actually, no, it's not car Oh, yeah, submarines, it's carrier. Right? It's oh, submarines what? right here, but I saw a carrier all popping up very quickly. Ah, uh, okay. <sighs> <laughs> Seeing mine not some movie riot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, no, uh. what did I do? <laughs> Stream unfair to mine. Yes, it's true if you only could mine for some more steel, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Can we add that, please? Wow. Natural focus. Maybe. Mine for steel. Maybe. Uh, All right, I, I might have been poking around at something yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> what know. happened with chat? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh god. Um, maybe we should just send our troops then to the front line. Yeah, I mean you got uh, you got ten minutes to kill them all, right? Yeah, that's no problem, no problem. Uh, let us leave. Let us do like this. Leave one division right there. All the seventeen right here. Just go up yeah. to the front line. 
put that guy as commander, you're going to get the I feel like, like what we should have done, though, is focus on paratroopers. Do you have the paratrooper check? No. Damn it. There was someone else who was going to focus on paratroopers, <laughs> but all our plans... <laughs> that, that, that cooperation. Yeah, like all our plans of making this a super nice, I'm going marines, you're going this, you're going yeah. this, kind of turned out... Uh, okay, let's just do everything. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Can I see you industry tax again? Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, you did get Nothing pretty special. far. Yeah. Yeah. Do you still like concentrated over dispersed? Depends. Like this is ridiculously good. Like yeah. ridiculous. I but guess you don't focus too right much now, on getting new right stuff. Right now, so. I kind of knew I wasn't gonna be get bombed. And yeah. uh, like we were probably not gonna go for very new tech very quickly because we were gonna go marines, which means all we're gonna switch is one, one, two yeah. times, basically for most of our equipment. Maybe here a bit more, but we wouldn't yeah. switch that often. That's why I decided just concentrated. But if I'm gonna play with tanks, with airplanes very much, and infantry, then definitely concentrate. Yeah. Uh, disperse an is much an better. extra artillery level there would have probably been nice, actually. Yeah. Uh, in relation to DevDi, will there be any interaction between uh. DoD focuses and the new German adjustments? That so I guess that's a good question. I so think I guess there they mean like the German interaction with Romanian stuff, and what will happen if they pick? Yeah, like there's a bit I think with the uh, industry uh, paths, right? But I haven't actually. I don't know the details on that one. Yeah. Uh, maybe if one of the content, content design. designers in there. Well, if we, if but we it might just be to avoid them going going wrong, basically. <laughs> like, if we know if something is happening right there, maybe they could just run down here. Yeah. If Drikus or someone else knows. Yeah, I mean, if he feels like he's he's stuck in the thing, but yeah. we, we can also feedback on you later. Yeah, I mean, stuff is course. still work in progress. We're fairly. We have we have uh, some time to go before everything's done. So. Yeah. But. Uh, but you can set up the whole commissariat stuff, right? So, uh, oh right, there, 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 there is definitely, um, definitely uh, interactions, right? But it's not necessarily interactive with, with a lot of the the dishonor stuff, right? We can just do a naval invasion directly from El Salvador itself, yeah. since it's only one province. But I think I might have thrown away my entire fleet now by now. Oh yeah. no, cool! We have two ships. Yeah, uh, let's unselect that. Yeah. And only select this province. Or province, province, sea zone. So maybe we can just get around right here. <laughs> I think you're just being hopeful here. Maybe. But I can try. There's there's always try. There's always try. There is no do. Oh wait, that's the reverse right. Yeah. I feel like we should have pushed porgs a bit more in this thing as well. I've been pestering everybody I work with. Porgs. Porgs? Por you missed the porgs. I missed the porgs. It's that cutesy creature in the new Star Wars trailer that's on for two seconds. I haven't watched the new Star Wars trailer. I don't wanna... Like, I hate trailers nowadays. They show the entire movie in them. Well, and yeah. I've seen so many trailers now. I'm like, that, if that's not the ending, then I... I yeah. And it's just, yeah, that was the ending. Or, yeah, oh, that's a the very downside. exciting moment that when that person is gonna die. Ah. Yeah, you've got the Stockholm Film Festival starting soon, so I was watching like 30 trailers yesterday, so yeah. I only watched the start of them, so they wouldn't spoil me. Ah, oh, there we go, Minecraft so singer has become mad, ban him. Let's boycott Paradox until they make Minecraft songs in before. So the question is, right, if I make a Minecraft song DLC, then I quit. how many would buy that? <laughs> I quit. Because, no. you know, you can't argue with the market forces, right? <laughs> Well, luckily, marketing never listens to this, so I think uh, we're fine. I don't know. <laughs> I, I could like, I could slack, uh, slack Valdutoft, get him to do some Minecrafty songs, right? Oh God! Would be good. What happened? <laughs> what happened with my dear Hoy? Uh, well, you know, I feel like you should probably do Minecraft playthrough now, where we just like focus on excavation and think. I don't know. Let's <laughs> know. <laughs> Let's just know. Oh no. Well, the CEO of EA likes that idea at least. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> uh, let's see. We have a small. Li is it that to transfer troops? Yeah. Uh, oh, it was another naval invasion. Oh. But I don't know how about yeah. the idea of invading. Yeah. Uh, sorry, uh, I guess five no. minutes I've totally derailed that. <laughs> the, um, are you going to do the Place the Classics thing? I want to, but um, well, I think it's a pretty long queue. 
Yeah. And my classics my is like a much, much newer game than everyone yeah, else. Yeah, because you, you weren't born when I played the classics. Exactly. <laughs> so, <laughs> like, I, I would like. To By the way, look at your political power. Yeah, six, six, six. <laughs> like, I, I would like to do probably Age of Empires, mm. the first one. Yeah, that's a good one. But it's released like ninety-seven or something. Yeah. I'm gonna. Um, I really want to do uh, Terror from the Deep, the old XCOM uh, sequel. We'll see if we can actually find it in a playable state somewhere. <laughs> but uh, I haven't seen if it's been like updated in any way. Let's just be mad with our divisions right here. Yeah. Let's be a snake. You stand everywhere. I know, I know them. Rome Total War. I love the H of Empire. H. <laughs> I didn't say Jack, H Jack, of Empire. Jack the Lions is a great one as well. H of Empires. Uh, Jack the Alliance. I, I don't even know what that is. Wait, what? You don't know what it is? No, not oh. Jack the Alliance. It's um, it's sort of what I what I wished XCOM three would have been, <laughs> or even over, uh, you know, after Terror from the Deep. Like, it's they basically add a lot more personality and stuff. You lead like a, a band of mercenaries. They all have more personalities and then shenanigans going on. Mm -hmm. that's similar, so it's like turn-based and, uh, and tactical and stuff like that. But didn't uh, for years played some game. And you're like, I think you're in like an unidentified South American country doing shenanigans. No. But but the for uh, for years played some game like banners or something. That was like you take control of a mercenary band, you advance them. There's also a new game coming quite soon oh, called um, like war banners or something, which also like a mercenary band. There's a new game, you mean? Yeah, uh, it's, it's a classic still in old yeah old classic style uh, it's not the one where he got his doom dark name from because uh, that one know. is from like commodore 64 or something no, so i don't before think so. my time no th this was a new game he bought on steam or something <laughs> he played when, during gamescom <laughs> during breaks uh, okay maybe that yeah. would be something uh battle brothers that yeah. one yeah it's pretty cool I, I've, I haven't had time to play very much yet but it's like i i, I became very interested uh, in it like i didn't think i would like it but yeah uh as for age of empires being 97 which to point out shape sure imperialist was also 97 make oh yeah. nice then i have justifications yeah justifications Wait. justification wow. but yeah we are messing up imperialism was in 97 wow <laughs> we are messing up with what you is like a ton right oh now. wow yeah i totally wasn't paying attention like there's an so enemy right here that blocked them from reinforcing yeah. here so where's the rest of the divisions though here <laughs> and probably a ton of them have been transferred over to europe Oh, probably. So we are messing the crap out of them. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you can't turn this now. I was going to end the <laughs> end the session. <laughs> you can't end the session speed without five. beating the Americans. Speed vibe, speed vibe. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I'm not host. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's see. Just the... wait until Age of Empires Definitive Edition it comes out in a few weeks. Like, I was super hyped for it. Yeah. I got to try it a tiny bit at Gamescom. Mm. So I talked with them, uh, talked a bit with the developers. Super cool guys. And apparently they love Solaris. Ooh. So we're like, yeah, maybe you can hook us up with... But do the they love Hux 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 Iron, though? I did it often, but the, the excitement wasn't as big, unfortunately. So oh. I was like asking them, maybe you can hit us up with uh, some uh, beta codes for that. They were like, yeah, sure. Nothing came. I, th I think that your is. your desperate begging for beta codes uh, only works if they're actually watching the stream, though. Yeah, no, no, but they said that we're gonna give some <laughs> before. They even took our mails, me and Daniels. Disappointment. This is desperate begging. Desperate begging. Yeah. Yeah. Like, if there's anything I'm gonna desperate beg for, it's probably that. Like, it was such a big part of me. Yeah. And we still control parts of uh, like uh, Africa right here. Yeah. Well, we got like one minute now left, so. Should we do a little summary here? I think. Yeah, it might be time for it. So, um, yeah, we were how many devs in the beginning? Yeah. Ten something. Yeah. And we created a massive, massive faction called Faction McFaction Face. Yeah. We did some. We blame Forum on that one, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it was your name, so yeah. we didn't do it. Uh, then we well in, took over the rest of South America with a couple of troubles back and forward. Mm. Um, the Allies. When we got to war with the Allies, we had Canada taking over half of our player base, but we managed to push them back and give them back to land. Um, we made some very nice peace deals, splitting up the nation completely yeah. fair and... 
But I, I mean, Very I think the plan glory. to get to Europe was a fairly sound one because the yeah. only place you can realistically get across there is going into Africa, right? Yeah. And we did it. Um, so technically, we succeeded in our sunset invasion. But <laughs> the problem is, we never really the made sunset invasion in the wrong place. But yeah. yeah. And then, uh, well, it seems like US did some well, yeah. shenanigans. But we are doing quite well right now. Let's see if we can yeah. reach US territory. Yeah. Oh, actually, we are, are, are yeah. already in US territory. Oh, yeah, I've seen the, the chat is asking, are there any Hoi beginner let's plays? So uh, well, we've been talking about may maybe doing some new ones. Exactly. Like may maybe may we should do that. <laughs> maybe that's maybe what we will do quite soon. Yeah. Could be a cool thing before we start uh, playing on hot code again. I think we're maybe some a few weeks off that. Ooh, exciting. I need to fix some some <laughs> big main stuff. <laughs> the problem is right uh, since we're redoing like the main interface uh, and stuff with it's the, a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, it's it's sort of like it's hard to avoid the areas that are still very in work in progress, right? Yeah, but hopefully we can bring you some very cool stuff very soon. Yes, but otherwise. Yeah, but let's uh, let's just call this. Let's hope that what we plan to do next week will work. Yeah. So I think um, it will work. So yeah, this will be the last episode of the Sunset Invasion because I don't think we can come back from this. Eventually, they will just kick the crap out of us. <laughs> as soon as soon as Germany falls, right? And they're, they've been losing even more now. I think. <laughs> but they're holding on. Or oh, they lost no, slightly they lost more right there. Bit there, right? They're yeah. still holding on, which is interesting. But uh, well, and I guess Italy. But you know, hot Romania code is not happening now. next week. It's no. hot code is probably in a couple of weeks, but we have something else planned for. Yeah, that's soon. Yeah, I, I would say at least uh, at least another three weeks. So. Yeah. So anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed our well sunset invasion with developers. That was a complete mess with coordination <laughs> and everything. You really need those pings. I, I talked about that with Kandra. Like, this would have been awesome with yeah. the pings. Like, just ping, let's invade right there. Let's counteract them right there. Oh, Kennedy's coming. Let's attack, defend yeah. right there. Yeah, Daniel's, by the way, talking about a thing that uh, that's coming in one yeah. in the new DLC, which is... Uh, you well, we had the dev diary last week on it. Oh, was it last week? Yeah, was that's week why before? I started talking about it. Ah, okay. Um, uh, yeah, it's <laughs> all I see is trees. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, but so you can ping the map basically, and it's way easier to coordinate when you're not on chat. Yeah, and for obvious reasons, we can't all be on chat for the stream because it'd be horrendous to listen to. Yeah, time stuff don't make it kick you again. Well, you can you can leave right now. We're just yeah. finishing the stream. Yeah, we're all uh, we're all done. Just yeah, ru run away, cowards! Run away. May God and Minecraft be with you. <laughs> Let's just end the stream. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll yeah. see you guys next see week. See you next week for something totally different. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Thank you.